Hi, I'm Chuck Halsey, Regional Wildlife Biologist in Western Maine. We're doing Canada Lynx Winter Track Surveys to determine presence, distribution, and abundance. This is located just east of New Hampshire and just south of the Canadian border. Helping with these winter surveys are Regional Biologist Scott Lindsay, Corey Stearns, Bob Cordes, and Kendall Martin. Adult male lynx are 33 inches long and weigh up to 30 pounds. Females are smaller. Tall, with oversized feet, they are perfectly adapted to hunt snowshoe hare in the deep snow of northern Maine. Their long black ear tufts and a tail that looks like the tip was dipped in black ink distinguishes them from their cousin, the bobcat. Surveys are run in a 48-hour window, starting 24 hours after a significant snowstorm has ended. To complete a survey, we must cover 33 to 48 miles in a township. Biologists have a lot of experience identifying tracks. We look at track size, pattern, and behavior of the animal. Looks like a lynx. The UTMs are 19T034457. Four and seven eighths inches. Track width four and a half inches. Stride thirty four and a half inches. Sinking depth two and seven eighths inches. Direct direction of travel southeast. Uh, the forest type is an S two B over an S one A. Happy spring from the second day of Link Survey at Pomagini Camp. So team one will go up on this side of the lake and cover this area. Team two will drop down to the snowmobile trail. And Looks like a coyote track. Okay, here we are in our link survey and we're just crossing the southwest side of Thrasher Peaks here. These are snowshoe hair tracks and you can see them bounding about seven feet in a leap. Here you can see where the surface was just strong enough to support the lynx entirely and what you see is our hair tufts. Seven inch straddle. 